I think it makes it a bit sweeter because, you know, before we'd even... But when the draw was made for this quarterfinal, a lot of people wrote us off um, before we'd even played. And, um, yeah, to, to to qualify for the semi-final and get through, um, obviously, um, it's great for us, great for the team. And, um, you yeah, um, know, we're really excited, really happy, tired as well. <laughs> Sicario, well done. Uh, this is Terry. I wanted to ask you a question on how you defended on those men. Every time the ball was on the side and the cross was about to go in, you defended old school in an old school way. You always went tight to him. You don't go to the spot, you played the man. Tell me more. We'll speak a lot more about you as we get to the semi final. But a little birdie tells me that uh, the guy who's just asked the question before me is one of your biggest idols. Now, what are your <laughs> thoughts of him as a pundit as well as a player? Yeah, I mean, as a player, of course. Um... You know, there's not much to be said. Um, like you said, you know, when I was growing up, uh, you know, Thierry, I hope you don't mind me embarrassing you like this, but um, yeah, I was a, uh, yeah, I was a big fan. He was a, he was uh, my idol. So um, obviously, I, uh, as I was getting older, I moved behind, um, further back the, back down the pitch. But um, yeah, obviously, uh, and as a pundit as well, it was really funny. You know, we was we were actually <laughs> watching. Um, <laughs> no, we're, 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 <laughs> no, I remember we were watching um the last game. We were watching um we were watching the video of when he was doing the guess who, and he guessed himself twice instead of Oli. Um, so, so, uh, yeah, it was really funny. Um, we were watching that the other day. In the mixer, that's yeah. what it does. Thierry, come on. No, listen. One thing. No, first and foremost, thank you. You, yeah, I, I got a bit red, you know, when you said that. But <laughs> I want to ask you a question. True, though. So. And especially, um, you know, when we need him, you know, sometimes when, um, you know, they get through our defence and um, he's got to make a world-class save, you know, like he did last week uh, against uh, Di Lorenzo late in the game. You know, having having someone like that behind us obviously gives us a lot of confidence. We can play a higher line, we can be a bit more aggressive and um, we can rely on him. So um, I think that's the that's the key thing. OK, for Corey. Last but not least, who was a better defender, Jamie Carragher or Big Beaks himself? <laughs> The fans want to know. Come the on. viewers want to see. Sorry, what did you, you say? I can't hear. <laughs> <laughs> Palo Italiano? Si, si, Palo Italiano. Oh, OK, understood. Who's better than me or Jamie? <laughs> when you were growing up, who was the most impressive defender? Who did you look up to? Is there anyone that stands out? Maybe somebody who was playing for Manchester City called Micah or someone at Liverpool called Jamie. Were they influencers for your idols? Yeah, both of them. I mean, obviously, as I said, Thierry's my idol, so I can't, I can't change my idol now. But, um, <laughs> Double down. But, uh, you know, obviously, go going, um, you know, growing up in, in the, the youth side at Chelsea, obviously, John Terry was, was a big um, oh, was a big reference no. for me. Um, <laughs> I, have to, I have to be honest. Have to be honest. Um, yeah, he, they, he was a big um, reference um, for me, but um, obviously, both, the both of you, obviously, Micah, I know you played in Italy, so... Um, <laughs> we got it! Ciao! appreciate your time and we do apologize as well for uh, Micah and Jamie's chronic mispronunciation of your name time and time again. I worried I was going to swear. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to go to a very quick break. Thank you so much for your time. We'll be right back with you. More Champions League on CBS Sports Network and Paramount Plus. Stay with us. <laughs>